garden beds are the perfect start for beginner gardeners, but it's best to go for vegetables with shallow roots considering the depth. These vegetables are easy to plant and remove at the end of the season. Even though they feed on the top layer of the soil, they yield delicious produce. Just think of a crunchy kale leaf or a juicy radish. Shallow roots are predominantly fibrous roots and rarely tuberous. Tuberous roots are more common in mid- or deep-rooted plants. But this doesn't mean your choice of vegetables with shallow roots is limited. Some of the tastiest vegetables can be grown in less than 8 inches of soil depth. Let's dive into the details of the shallow roots. Picking Vegetables for Garden Beds Garden beds or boxes are ideal for planting seasonal and easy-to-grow vegetables. One raised bed in a few containers can yield enough produce to provide your family with fresh salads for the whole summer. Almost all vegetables with shallow roots thrive in full sun. Consider this when positioning your pots or garden boxes. Make sure you fill them with good soil, a rich blend of compost or aged manure, and stay away from garden soil. These vegetables feed on the top layer of the soil, so you want them to be rich in nutrients. Shallow Roots Pros and Cons Vegetables with shallow roots absorb water more quickly than those with deeper roots. They have a larger surface area, allowing them to forage the top layer of the soil. These vegetables have fibrous roots that enable them to anchor perfectly in small garden beds. Shallow roots also need more moisture, especially if exposed to plenty of sunlight. The sun dries the top layer of the soil where the roots are positioned. As a result, vegetables with shallow roots are more likely to suffer from weather changes and stress. The best shallow rooted vegetables. Onion. Onions are easy to grow, low maintenance vegetables with shallow roots. Plant them in spring as soon as the last frost has passed, and the soil is workable. They don't require much space, you can place each seed one to two inches apart. Garlic. Garlic roots stretch 2 to 24 inches, depending on the type. You can plant it at the beginning of fall or four weeks before your last frost date. It's easy to grow, but you might need to fertilize it and look for pests. Lettuce. Have fresh lettuce on hand for the whole season by planting new seeds every two weeks. Cut the outer leaves, and the center will keep on growing. You can start sowing in early to mid-spring, positioning the seeds 4 to 5 inches apart. Spinach The iron-rich salad is easy to grow year-round in around 6 inches of soil. Spinach is a very hardy vegetable. It can thrive in chilly weather and full sun but won't tolerate temperatures over 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Cabbage Many cruciferous vegetables with shallow roots are part of the cabbage family. The roots of the standard cabbage are the longest at 18 to 30 inches deep. Chinese cabbage has 12-inch roots as well as bok choy and Brussels sprouts. Broccoli. They're easy to grow, nutritious, and delicious vegetables with shallow roots. Broccoli rob is the easiest and fastest to grow. They need to be planted 15 inches apart, so consider this if you're working with a small space. Kale. Kale grows best in cooler weather around fall and spring. However, shallow-rooted kale doesn't produce huge leaves. You can grow baby kale in a spot exposed to the sun for at least 4 to 6 hours a day. Arugula Arugula or rocket is among the vegetables with shallow roots that reach 12 to 18 inches. You need to plant this delicious salad green in spring after the frost has passed and the soil is 40 degrees Fahrenheit to 55 degrees Fahrenheit. Radishes Like many other vegetables with shallow roots, they're easy to grow but need plenty of suns. Otherwise, they will develop more foliage and less produce. Plant them in August or September and enjoy a harvest in 20 to 60 days. Conclusion most vegetables with shallow roots are easy to grow and can become a staple in your kitchen. Even though they don't reach the deep layers of the soil, they're still one of the most nutritious vegetables. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.